The International Convention for the Prevention of Pollution from Ships, MARPL, is the main international convention covering prevention of pollution of the marine environment by ships. The garbage produced on board ships needs to be properly disposed of as stated by the MARPL Annex 5. Garbage is one of the several reasons which have been responsible for marine pollution at sea. As per the MARPL Annex 5, the garbage produced on the ship includes domestic, operational, and all other types of vital waste, excluding fresh fish and parts thereof, generated during the normal operation of the ship and liable to be disposed of continuously or periodically except those substances which are defined or listed in other annexes to the present convention. Stringent rules and regulations have therefore been made and implemented in order to prevent ships from disposing waste at the sea. According to Marple Annex 5, this garbage regulation applies to all the ships which are operating in the marine environment, including merchant ships, fixed or floating platforms, non-commercial ships like yachts, pleasure crafts, ferries, etc. All vessels need to display instructions along with placards to inform the ship's crew and passengers regarding disposal requirements of garbage. Moreover, it is mandatory that every ship of 400 gross tonnage and above which is certified to carry 15 passengers or more must carry a garbage management plan and a garbage record book. On 01 SC March 2018, the MEDC committee introduced an amendment to Marple Annex 5 which differentiates between hazardous and non-hazardous waste. Post this amendment, the garbage record book is divided into two parts considering those ships which carry cargoes in bulk solid form and with a new category inclusion of e-waste produced on ships. Classes of garbage on ships. Garbage on board ships are classified into various categories in order to facilitate easy handling and disposing of. Garbage on ships is classified into the following. 1. Plastics. 2. Floating dunnage, lining, and packing material. 3. Ground down paper products, rags, glass, metal bottles, and crockery. 4. Domestic waste. 5. Incinerator ash. 6. Normal paper products, rags, oily rags, glass, and metal scrap. 7. Operational waste. 8. Animal carcasses on board livestock carrier. 9. E-waste. 10. Cooking oil waste produced in the galley. 11. Cargo residues on board ships carrying solid cargo in bulk, which are not harmful to the marine environment. 12. Cargo residues on board ships carrying solid cargo in bulk, which are harmful to the marine environment. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more.